Hello, science students. On Wednesday, I'm going to have a guest teacher while I go to a curriculum meeting. That means today we're going to practice a little bit of what it might look like while I'm not there. What's going to happen is I'm going to post an announcement for you for that day, and it's going to have a list of things that you need to complete during the class period while the guest teacher is there. Instead of just dropping you into that with no practice, we're going to practice that a little bit today. So task number one today, just above this video, there's going to be a link to the Top 10 Tuesday form so that you can fill that out like we normally do on Top 10 Tuesdays. This week's Top 10 is school supplies. So, you know, get excited about the end of the quarter and maybe reorganizing your binder a little bit. Uh, the next thing we're going to do in this class is we're going to go ahead and finish uh, working on Journal 11A. We'll probably go through the slides in 11A together. I will provide a link to that journal, these sets of slides, uh, in this announcement underneath this video. If you're finished with that, feel free to watch the video underneath as well. Once you've completed that, we're going to go a little bit out of order today. So once we've finished uh, taking our notes about Newton's third law, we're going to go ahead and get your partners picked so you can start planning for the Balloon Gondola Engineering Design Contest. You're going to get a few items for that, a balloon, some tape, two pieces of colored paper, a couple of note cards, and any other supplies that are simple, Home supplies, you would be able to get at something like a grocery store, but make sure you ask permission first. Um, and what you're going to see on Wednesday is you're going to be working on building that as kind of the second thing you're going to do during that class period. The only thing that's a little bit unfortunate is I'm probably not going to give you the balloon because I don't want the guest teacher to have to deal with people blowing up balloons and them flying around the room. But you can build the structure that goes around it and kind of complete your plan. Once you've finished your design plan with your partner in class that we'll choose together, then we'll go ahead and if there's time remaining, we're going to work on Journal 11B, which similar to the last couple of weeks is a set of questions that is within a Google Slide Deck. So you can work through these questions one at a time as a way to practice your understanding of friction. Okay, so hopefully that makes sense and you're able to find these things. I'm going to link them right in the announcements so that they're easy to find. And if you have any questions, let me know. Good luck.